The Legend of Zelda live action movie was just confirmed. It's time for the latest news out of Japan. Earlier in the year, we reported on Nintendo becoming more of an entertainment company, and this latest announcement is a sign of that. The success of the Super Mario movie and other video game movie adaptions is irresistible. Nintendo, on their official X account, posted a statement from Miyamoto stating, I have been working on the live action film of The Legend of Zelda for many years now with Avi Arad-san, who has produced many mega hit films. The statement would continue, I have asked Avi-san to produce this film with me, and we have now officially started the development of the film with Nintendo itself heavily involved in the production. Now. Who is Miyamoto and who is Avi? Miyamoto is the creator of The Legend of Zelda, but not only that, he created Mario, Donkey Kong, Star Fox, and more. The man is a legend. The other individual mentioned, Avi Arad, is a film producer. Not just any film producer though, he is also a legend. Works he's been involved with include Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse, Morbius, all of Tom Holland's Spider-Man movies, and much more. Fan reaction to this news is very positive, as it should be. Video game movies in recent times have been great, and the project is in good hands. Or is it? There are those that come to despise the work of Avi Arad. One fan went as far to post a meme saying that it's in God's hands now. Another joke that he'll put Venom in the Zelda universe. The jokes go on and on, so yeah. The man has his haters. There are of course those that wish this was an animated film, but the reception is for sure very positive. There is one concern though, and that is the portrayal of Link in the live action adaption. If you've played Zelda games, you know that Link doesn't really talk. His dialogue is limited to grunts and battle cries. This could be strange in a live action format, and it's a debate fans are having right now. Do you think Link should talk? Let us know in the comments. There is another important topic being discussed now, and that is, who should play these characters? Everyone seems to have their picks, but there seems to be a strong sentiment that Tom Holland would be the nightmare choice for Link. We don't know if that'll happen, but we do know that the movie will be produced by Nintendo and Arad Productions Inc., and Westfall will direct the film. On the financial side, Nintendo will finance more than 50% of the movie, and Sony Pictures will handle the worldwide theatrical distribution. The project, if executed well, will surely bring great revenue. The Super Mario movie has grossed 1.3 billion. Sonic's second movie grossed over $405 million. The Zelda movie is likely to fall somewhere between those two estimates. The release date won't be anytime soon based on the release statements. And so, while Zelda prepares for a new beginning, Nintendo as a company does as well. More about that on screen now.